Partly cloudy, mild conditions. All the storms are off to the east of us now. You can see that line of thunderstorms off to our east, and we actually do have a severe thunderstorm warning out uh, just to the east of Lyman now until 545. That's that same line of storms, mostly producing gusty winds, but not a whole lot else. As far as the highs today, we hit 73. 44 was the low. Right now in Denver, we're currently at 67 at our studio, 64 at the airport and the barometer falling 29.89. So the isolated showers and a few storms off to the east, mostly clear by midnight and by morning. We'll just have some high clouds, mild conditions expected. Lows will drop down to about 45 in Denver, out at Lyman 37, 42 at Burlington, 27 at Leadville, 49 out west at Grand Junction. In the mountains, mostly in the 30s. On the plains, mostly in the low 40s. A mild morning under mostly sunny skies. By midday tomorrow, it is just warm and dry. By the afternoon, it'll be mostly cloudy, but it stays warm and dry with the highs back into the middle 70s, even some upper 70s to near 80 off to the east of us, 50s to near 60 expected in the mountains across the state. Pretty warm over the southeast. We we'll get up to 83 at Pueblo, also Ray in Burlington, 87 at Lamar out west, 78 at Grand Junction, 73 at Cortez, and 70 expected at Durango. We're warm and dry tomorrow. There'll be a fast moving cold front come through on Friday. Little bit of precipitation, not a whole lot. The winds will increase, but nothing like last Friday. Saturday looks like a nice day, cool and dry. Sunday, another quick little storm coming in may produce some late day showers, but overall a pretty good day. Super 7 day, 78 tomorrow, 62 on Friday and 65 Saturday. There is some moisture coming our way, primarily for the mountains through early Friday. And after that, we'll dry back out again. Sunday, 63, maybe a few late day showers, 68 Monday. Tuesday 65 and partly cloudy and 72 next Wednesday.